Welcome to PSLE Maths, where you find solutions to PSLE Math problems. Please subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon for notification. Thank you. Let's look at a question from Henry Park Primary School, 2019 prelims paper. This is question number 17. Two square tiles of equal sides are shown below. Some parts of the tiles are painted in the shape of identical quarter circles. A floor is laid with the tiles that follow a pattern as shown below. The floor measures 5.2 meters in length and 3.6 meters in breadth and is completely covered with the tiles. The question is find the area of the floor that is covered by the painted parts of the tiles. So this is a four mark question. First thing we need to do is the length and breadth of the floor is given in meters while the sides of the tiles is given in centimeters. So first we convert the floor measurements into centimeters. So 3.6 meters the breadth is equal to 360 centimeters and 5.2 meters the length is equal to 520 centimeters. The second thing is each tile is 20 centimeters by 20 meters a square tile. So we need to find out how many square tiles can be fit into this floor area. Along the breadth 360 divided by 20 so total 18 tiles can be fit and along the length 520 divided by 20 which is 26 tiles can be fit. So now let's look at the pattern of the tiles that are repeating. We see that a set of 6 tiles is repeating as shown in the picture. So this 3 by 2 let's call it one set. So how many such 6 tile set can be fit along the width which is 18 tiles and there are 2 tiles in this set. So 18 divided by 2 equal to 9. 9 such 6 tile sets can be fit along its breadth. And how about the length? There are a total of 26 tiles while the 6 tile set has 3 tiles. So 26 divided by 3 which is 8 reminder 2. What that means is 8 full 6 tile sets can be fit and 2 rows would be vacant or rather a complete set cannot be fit rather the first 4 tiles alone can be fit. So let's now first find out how many full set can accommodate. So the width is 9 and the length is 8. So 9 times 8 equal to 72 full sets can be fit. So a set here is a set of 6 tiles. So we can see that each of the 6 set has one full painted circle and two semicircles which means that's a total of two full circle area. So 72 times 2 there are 144 circles so far in the floor area. Now let's look at the last two column which the pattern would repeat only the first four tiles. So again since there are the, this 4 tiles is 2 by 2, along the width there will be 18 divided by 2 which is equal to 9 such sets. While along the length is the last 2 column. So there is just 1. And we see that in this set of 4 tiles, there are 3 semi-circular uh, painted patterns. So a total of 1 and a half full circles. So 9 times 1 and a half is 13 and a half or 13.5 full circles. So that makes the total number of painted circles 144 plus 13.5 which is 157.5. So now we find the area of one painted circle which is pi r square pi 
is given as 22 by 7 here in this question. So we use 22 by 7 times R. R is the radius of the quarter circle that is given which is 14 centimeters. So 14 times 14 which is equal to 616 centimeters square. So this is the area of one painted circle. To find out the total painted area, we already found out there are 157 and a half such circles. So 157.5 times 616 which is equal to 97,020 centimeters square. So this is the area that would be covered by the painted parts of the tile. So that's the answer for this question. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe to this channel for more problem sums. If you have a specific question that you would like to see a video on, please post it in the comment section. Thank you.